Hello and welcome in the 15th part of my tutorial and this tutorial will cover two topics that are hand joints these and an anim texture animation so I will show for first I will show you a preview as you can see the textures are moving from up to down and you can animate them any like right to left or whatever you want so now how it works how it happened so in the case of in joint you can add it by here go to physics and then in joint it will automatically add a rigid body and you can make it either heavier which means the object will be uh, heavy difficult to move means you have to add more so I, this is a better technique that. like see how much slowly are they and now you can see the difference easily and now in the hinge joint there are three things that I have configured anchor 0 0 0 which means the point which uh, that you are making the center point of your object through movie and the main axis on which it will rotate and now axis axis means the point means the this arrow this one uh, over the blue arrow means in which direction uh, will the rotation occur like uh, I couldn't explain it but see like uh, if I on Z axis it will rotating like this and on <coughs> Y axis it will rotate like this and that's how axis works and another thing is use limits uh, which means that this um, hinge joint can all um, move can only rotate till 35 degree minim minimum and minus 35 degree maximum and you can set them here minimum the minimum rotation the maximum rotation minimum bounce means the bouncing back and maximum means you can also configure these U springs means getting back to its original position like I actually don't know how to work in it but it should work like this means like a spring and then they use motor motors means rotating uh, try this and then brake force and torque etc 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 and then this finish and uh, this is just a texture and the animation is like this means select the object and then select its material you should have me there should be one anything and then main off main texture dot offset offset dot X and then Y and you can animate them and like from up to down and left to right from Y from right to left from Y and then up to down from Z you can also change their scaling like when you hit them uh, they appear larger I will show you this like add key and 
make them two so would it be enough see this scaling then two then one it is usually how much means texture can be made here and if you and if I make minus two let's see what happens see this is just some tricky things to do and they are used in many games as you would have seen like this thing is used in most wanted for and other NFS games what happened Oof. sorry but I have to complete again and this time I will show you see first time in 0 0 0 it was 0 that you can see here and then here I made it 1 so see this thing happened and I made it loop and warp mode loop and so the animation plays like this and it's very easy it isn't too much mm, difficult so use it in your games make your games more interesting thank you please like comment share Thank you.